This video will show you how to refine your database search results using subjects. When you are just beginning your research on a topic, it is very common to have to run your search multiple times to get results that are most relevant to your topic. I am interested in researching celebrities' influence on elections. I ran my initial search of celebrities' election. The database will automatically insert the word AND in between my two search terms. As I scroll through my initial results, I am looking for articles that best fit with my topic. It is important to read the abstract of an article to really find out what it's about instead of just going off the article's title. This article appears to be relevant to my research, so I would like to find more articles like it. To further refine my search results, I can use the subjects that have been assigned or tagged to the article. The subject, Celebrities Political Activity, fits my research topic more closely than just celebrities. So I will rerun my search by copying and pasting that subject into the search box along with my other search term, Election. By putting the subject in quotation marks, my search results will only include articles that have been tagged with those exact words. I have now 10 articles that are about my topic. If I wanted more articles on this topic, I could broaden my search by taking out my search term, election, and rerunning my search again. Subjects also allow you to expand your search by discovering additional topics related to your initial search. For example, I have seen practical politics tagged on several articles that I have found interesting, so that may be a topic that I should further explore. As you can see, the search process takes a lot of trial and error. Using subjects can help you narrow your search and get articles that are more relevant to your topic. For help on this topic and more, check out our Answers database where you can search our Frequently Asked Questions or chat with a Rasmussen librarian.